Building Ham and Sons Building Supply and Septic Tanks. Welcome back to Good Day Time. Now it is 839 in today's hometown hotspot. Some of our Good Day Columbia crew took the trip over to Newberry. So let's check in with my co-anchor Candace Murphy, who's live this morning, learning about a local business that's been very instrumental in Newberry County. Hey, Candace. Hey, that's exactly right, Freddie. Good morning. Well, of course, hometown hotspot right here in Newberry. Like we've been telling you all morning is sponsored by Willingham and Sons, and I'm joined by Austin Willingham this morning, who has a very uh, interesting and great family story about his business. First of all, good morning, Austin. Good morning. How are you? I'm great. Thank you for inviting us to your city. Oh, absolutely. It's a pleasure to have you here. Yeah, it's been so much fun. Tell me a little bit about your business, and then we'll get into the history of it. Uh, our business is Willingham and Sons Building Supply right here in Newberry, South Carolina. Uh, we're a family business, third generation. We've been around for 44 years. Uh, we were started in 1974 by my grandmother and grandfather. Mm -hmm. uh, my grandmother's at home sitting in front of the TV right now watching. <laughs> so uh, we're uh, very excited to uh, be be around this long. And uh, yeah. so. Now you told me that your grandfather actually started, and your grandmother started the business about 100 yards from their home. And it's right. just taken off ever since from three employees to 30 now. What does it mean to be part of something like that that's generational? It's exciting. Uh, every single day when you get to work, uh, walk through those doors, you, you kind of feel the history of it. Um, you kind of know that your granddad put his, his life's work into it. And uh, it means a lot. Uh, as, as you mentioned, growing from three employees to 30 is, is something special. Um, don't know where the, what the future holds, but may grow from there. We'll have to see. Yeah, certainly. So it's you and your um, father, your cousins, your uncle. So a, really a family affair. Why have you guys decided to stay put in this city? Well, the best answer is why wouldn't you? Uh, Newberry is a great place. Uh, we're centrally located between Greenville and Columbia. Um, luckily for us, our property is uh, one mile off I-26, so we're easy access to going wherever our deliveries may take us. Um, brings in a great range of customers, whether it be from the upstate or Midlands. Sure. So, um, and just look around. I mean, look around. It's, it's a great it's atmosphere. So, yeah, we. We couldn't really imagine being anywhere else. Yeah, and it's so neat too. You don't often hear about family businesses like that anymore that are generational, third generation, staying in the family. And I know that you guys probably enjoy working with each other. And like you said, Taste of Newberry today, you're probably going to see some of your cousins Absolutely. there, right? Absolutely. You, you never know when you pop into one of the events, whether it be the Taste of Newberry or the Pork in the Park, or yeah. you never know you're going to run into. And a lot of times it's some of your family members. Right. So um, yeah, like, as you mentioned, it's a true family business. We uh, we have, I think, seven or eight employees of the 30 that are, wow. are our first uh, family, so That's um, very yeah. unique. Yeah. absolutely, it's, it's something we enjoy. Well, thank you for having us this morning, uh, Austin, and thanks for being part of our show this morning. And we're going to toss it back to you in the studio. And I guess if you live in Newberry, you best be on your best behavior because uh, people are going to know what you do, right? Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we'll toss it back to you guys. We'll be back with more to close out the show right here in the city of Newberry.